If you're asked to factor the equation x squared plus 8x minus 9 equals 0, here's how you do it. First thing we want to do is set up a skeleton equation. That's this right here. Then we can add the signs. So I see the last term is negative, negative 9. Last term is negative. We're going to put a positive and a negative in our skeleton equation, like this. Once we have that, we can find the factors for the last term. That's this 9 up here. And they should add together to give us the middle term. So let's write the factors for 9. And that's really it. So I can see there's a difference of 8 between 1 and 9. So I'm going to put 1 and 9 up here. I think I'll put the 9 here and the 1 here. And then we can check our work with the FOIL method. First, outside, inside, and last. When we do that, we get, and I can see negative x and 9x, that would give me 8x. And that's what I'm looking for we can combine these terms right here and we'd end up with x squared plus 8x minus 9 equals 0. That's what we started with. So we know we factored this correctly. If we put the negative 1 here and the 9 here, this wouldn't work out and then we could switch them. Let's take a look at the values for x here that will make this whole statement 0. 0 equals 0. That's a true statement. So I could say x plus 9 equals 0, x would equal a negative 9, or x minus 1, that equals 0, so x would equal 1. If I put 1 in for x and you do the math, this all equals 0. If you put negative 9 in for x and you do the math, all of it equals 0 as well. So we've done this correctly. If you use the quadratic equation, you'll get these same answers here. So that's it. This is Dr. B factoring the equation x squared plus 8x minus 9 equals 0. Thanks for watching.